Over there is fine. Ruth, it's Paulina. Patch me through to Morgan. Paulina, how was your flight? Long. Uh, did you get the email that I sent you? Great location. Lots of red tape, though. I can get us through it. I'm sure you can, but Thomas won't go for it. Unless he knows exactly what he's getting into. I'll get him the specs on every inch of this place. Try to enjoy yourself. It's a tropical island, for God's sake. I'll relax when I have your office. No, <laughs> slow down. I might have another year left in me. You put in a good word for me? Every chance I get. You know, take care of yourself and keep me posted. Okay, Morgan, see you. Have a day! Welcome to Resort Saipan. My name is Tony. And here are your Bojo Bordados. I... Thank you. Uh, it's a gift from the natives of Saipan. Depending how you place them, different wish. This is for children. Gracias, that will be all. Adios. Enjoy your stay in Saipan. Coffee? Yes, please. <clears throat> Coffee, cream, no sugar. To go. Good memory. Huh. Any sign of Dave? Yeah, he's out shooting the cargo ships coming in. Hey, did your brother get back to you this morning? Yeah, he did. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for asking. I'm sure it's all gonna work out. Everything will be all right. We all gotta grow up sometime, right? <laughs> That's Alan. Paulina, wow. Hi. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Alan, this is my associate, Tyler. He's my architectural consultant. Tyler. Yep. Great to meet you. <laughs> well, I'll go find Dave. You want some coffee? <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> no, I'm fine. Dave. Hey. Hey. <laughs> uh, long time to see. Paulina, great to see you. It's good to see you. How's island life been treating you? Amazing as ever. Hey, Tyler. <laughs> I picked up the shirt in Tokyo. What does it say? Watashi wa America, the Ichiban no hentai des. I'm America's number one pervert. <laughs> Son of a bitch. The salesperson said it was a very funny shirt. It is. Press it. I'm reading. Japanese, not knees and language to master. Uh, my pronunciation's for shit, but I can stumble through a conversation. <laughs> Me, I prefer to speak dollars and cents. A language the whole world understands. You know what I mean? Shall we? Hey, what are they protesting about? Yeah, the property we're headed to, actually. Shouldn't Thanks. worry. Natives never go anywhere near it. Wait till you see this place. You gotta see it. It's, it's uh, 20 acres. Is that your guy? Yeah. I don't know. Pepe, what the hell is this? You don't like it? All good rents taken. Plus, you always say to save money, boss. My cousin give us good deal. Just help them with their stuff. Okay, okay, golly. Um, it's... Yeah, it's good. Thanks. 
seems odd that the locals are protesting the sale like they never go there. During World War II, some of the natives went missing, probably worked to death by the Japanese. My guess is they want to put a memorial up. So if we obtain the land, we'll just make it a part of our construction. Oh, somebody's been doing their homework, huh? <laughs> he was sacred burial ground before Japanese even come. From early Spanish colonies, they bring deceased and bad men. A lot of our people die. <laughs> anyway, the point is, is that the Japanese are the ones that desecrated the land, but now it's just prime real estate. Pepe's right. There's a lot of folklore dating back to the Spanish colonization. Nobody cares about the Spanish or the locals. It's the World War II aspect that the history buffs are after. There's tours given on the island already, but you guys could run your own from the new resort. I'm more interested in the folklore. It's a burial ground. Shouldn't the natives be visiting it out of respect? Not normal ground. They think it is a cursed place. Superstitious son of beaches. Which doctors give Saipan bad name? We're modern people now. Like Americans and Japanese. This place sounds wonderful. It's going to make it difficult to hire local staff. <laughs> you offer them a couple of bucks and you watch superstition fly out a window. Money trumps fear every time. Worked on me, boss. See? Nothing to worry about. I got a set of these in my room, but they were way nicer than this. Bojobo dolls, local good luck charms. Not always. The way they're tied signifies the wish. Hey, what do these mean? That we should keep out. <laughs> Back inside. It's a little further up. Now that's a view. Did I deliver or what? It's nice, but there's a lot of trees that will need clearing. Are the utilities routed out this far? <laughs> Just two miles up the road. Really? <laughs> Paulina, the beauty of this place is how untouched it is. Which makes it an expensive development. Oh. <laughs> I see. Morgan has taught you well. Mm. Hmm. There's a lovely clove down the way with a wolf. Hey Dave, Alan's gonna show you a waterfall. Grab whatever else you can get. Tyler and I are gonna scout the beach. Meet us down there in an hour. I'm thinking two infinity pools facing this side with a V-shaped structure. You know it'll maximize balconies with this view. Or you could work with the landscape. Consider three tiers of bungalows, right? Jungle, beach, over water. Push the romance factor. Sell it as exclusive to honeymooners and couples. Cuts down on clearing costs. And you can push the eco-friendly factor to the locals. Hmm. I like it. But don't give Alan an inch if we want a good price. So how long have you known Alan? 
not long. Amazing. I haven't seen this species before. Do either of you know what it is? Yeah. That's Pervertus Americanus. <laughs> what is that thing? Hydrosol atomizer. Very good for the skin. It has aromatic qualities. Yeah, forget I asked. What do you think? This place has potential. <laughs> All right. But being so remote, it would complicate construction. A lot. What are you guys talking about? This place is dying to be a five-star resort. See? Dave with his photographer's eye, he sees it. <laughs> Speaking of which, Dave, can we get some aerial? Thought you'd never ask. This here's the X8M drone. State of the art and ready to fly. We'll have footage of this entire property in under an hour. Is that internet? Oh. Wait, Dave, can you go over that last section again? Got it. Zoom in. I thought you said no one comes here. Well, whoever it is, they're trespassing. Well, they, no, they look like they're headed somewhere specific. Probably to the bunker. Bunker? It's just an old machine gun nest. It's nothing. We'll need to see it. They're latchy stones. It's thought they were pillars that Chamorro people built their houses on. That's what white man digs. These mark way to Zulares. Sacred ground. Really? Tautamonas. Very strong spirits place the latchy stones. When trespassers come without permission, they become very angry. Best not to touch. <laughs> He's screwing with you! <laughs> Listen, you can keep these up for cultural value, or you can level the whole place. Always thought it'd make a great tennis court. Buyer's choice, of course. Private property, come on out! Pepe! On it, boss. Oi! This senior humor long work we need! Anda! A town nation of town town! I pistol like we! Did he just say you have a gun? He's bluffing. Ignorant bastard. I know you spoke Spanish, but tomorrow I use the same Spanish words. Knock that egg! Hey! Debbie, they are not gay. If we know. Uh, 
<clears throat> what did he say? Superstitious bullshit. Like my mother used to say. How deep do you think it goes down? Could be ten feet. Could be a mile. What was that? It's nothing, Dave. You know there's no real reason to go down there, right? Your people could just wall up that entrance and we'd be done. What do you think? If it runs under the property, it could create a structural issue. Better take a look. Yep. We'll definitely need a full survey. We're uh, not really equipped for cave exploration. Yeah, Tyler's got a point there, you know. Um, look, why don't we hire a full excavation team as soon as we're in escrow? Thomas won't sign off on an unknown property. We need to see what's down here. It's your call. Polly now. Let's do it. Dave. Front and center, I want to get all this on video. You said this was just a machine gun nest. Well, look, that's what I was told, all right? Had you never bothered to check? It looks solid. I sure hope so. the Marines didn't strip this place for souvenirs. Who's to say they ever found it? This is nowhere near where the Americans invaded. Somebody didn't clean up after themselves. It looks like that somebody was real hungry. How far does this go? Well, that's what we're trying to figure out. All right, let's go for it. Oh, come okay. on. Only that. Coming, boss? Uh, yeah.
Whoa. That's a real dead body. We can all see that, Dave. I, uh, I had no idea there was anything like this down here. I, listen, Pepe, I'll get a full team to take care of the remains. I would hope so. Uh, Paulina. Paulina, hold on. Dave. Dave. Come on. Let's go. woman be doing down here in wartime? She could have been a prisoner, a spy, or... But she's wearing slacks. Women in the 40s wore skirts. Maybe her dress got ruined. Does it really matter? Pepe. Shh. Thought I hear something. A ghost? A ghost? Really? Yeah, really. You're an idiot. And you're an asshole. breathing. What are you trying to tell us? Let me see that footage. Let go. What are you doing? Delete. 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 I mean, that was self-defense, right? You saw him, he ran at me, he attacked me. I mean, Jesus Christ, he was practically dead when we got here. I mean, look at him! How did he know your name? How the hell should I know? Maybe he locked him down here years ago. Don't be ridiculous, Dave. Who are you calling? Hey, who are you calling? Exactly to the no. local police department.
<coughs> Is everyone okay? I think so. I've been better. <sighs> Turned on the lights. What the hell was that? Who cares? Ah, let's just get out of it before it happens again. Broke the damn light. You're paying for this. Shut up. Old man is gone. Wasn't even dead. The others are gone, too. This isn't right. What? Come on. We should get out of here. But it's not... Oh, you have got to be kidding me! Oh, now what? What do you mean? I mean it won't budge. Help! Somebody help us! Let us out! We left that open, I swear. We should never have come out here. Does anybody else have a signal? Dead. You two pissed off those natives and they locked us in here. We didn't do it! We don't even know these assholes! Just let us out! Dave! 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 Calm down! Calm down! Alright? Look, it doesn't matter anymore, okay? We just need to find another way out. Yeah. This should be right. They wouldn't have just one exit. If the enemy blew it up, everyone would be trapped. What is that sound? God bless. God bless Tyler. God bless Paulina. It's me. I'm praying. Thought you said you weren't superstitious. Brain can't hurt, yeah? Well, it's annoying, so knock it off! I'm sorry, boss. Dave's right. There has to be another way out. We should check in here again. Maybe there's a back door. This has to be a different room. But it looks identical. Just like... This is definitely the same room. Same bed, same spot. It's not possible. Yes. Not possible. Maybe those native people are messing with us. They could have cleaned it all up while we were knocked out. There couldn't have been more than five minutes between the quake and the lights coming back on. There's no way. Are you sure? Clean up like this, it would take days. It just doesn't add up. Maybe we're on a different level. What do you mean? Like same floor plan, different level. We might be one floor down. But why go to all that trouble? Jesus! Who cares? There's not another exit in this room, so let's go. He's got a point. I'm going this way. No, we should stick together. Yeah, I'm done following your lead. Pepe? Alan. We'll cover more ground this way. Pepe! There must be a way out here somewhere. I don't think there's any way out. Are you quitting on me? Should've come here. Autonomous or angry? Autonomous? I thought you were modern people, Pepe! Modern people don't know everything, yeah? You show me that, boss. What did you say? You 
You listen to me, Pepe. If you think I'm going the wrong way, then you feel free to run back after the others and see where that gets you. No, boss. They're not going the right way either. I tell you. Nobody gets out. Shut up, Pepe. Japanese, do you speak Japanese? I can ask where toilet is. You made that work. Come on, baby. Sorry, boss. Nothing about toilet here. I think this was lying there. says, my sins are too many. They haunt my dreams. I will make amends with my life. Then the dreams will stop. I guess he made them stop. Uh, guys. Oh. Hey, hey. Hey, hey.入り口から投げと出られない。他に出口はないのですか。もうない。出口なんかない。出口はないんだよ。これはあなたのですか。
Who the hell is that? This guy just came in and started waving his gun around. Mm -hmm. Well, and then... no fuck, boss. You... Shut up. He could have shown us a way out. He found a way. Bullshit. We found a radio, but everything's labeled in Japanese. Take me there. Run. No, boss. Nobody gets out. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Damn it. Hmm. I got something. Japanese. Great. Just talk to them. Um, Kikomaska. 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 It, it's a recorded message. It just keeps repeating. What's it say? Um, it's an imperial order. Civilians who commit suicide get the same spiritual status as soldiers who die in battle. Hey, try another frequency. Kikomaska. Yeah. Isn't it, Paulina, hmm? Just great! Once I set you outside, I said, hire a professional team. Day, 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 day. I gave you first crack at this property as a favor. I have like three other buyers out there, all ready to sign, ready to bring in their own professional team, just like you should have done. If they'd even found out about it before they started construction, maybe if you hadn't lied listen, about it. Listen, listen. All this arguing isn't doing anybody any good. We just need to find another way out, all right? Hey, Dave, are you okay? I'm fine. Did we reach someone? No. Well, no, 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 no.
Which way do we go? Well, I'm going this way. It's your lead. I'll take it. Hey guys, what about Pepe? He's probably off hiding in some corner, so screw him. Japanese didn't carve this. Definitely not. <sighs> Smells awful. <laughs> More Latte stones? I read about it in a book on Chamorro folklore. This was a burial site for the ancient chiefs. These were the first Bajobo dolls, and they held the spirits of an ancient chief and his bride, whose bond was eternal. That's why all the dolls come in pairs now. By separating the two, a curse was formed. His bride was kept above ground, but the chief was buried down here. The Spanish commander who did terrible things to the Chamorro people during the first colonization. The chief suffering for his lost love would be equally eternal, and that torment would be felt by the commander. Who's supposed to still be down here? And still alive? Oh my god, that is the biggest crock of shit I've ever heard. These people believed it enough to paint it on the wall. To ward off foreigners. There's probably treasure buried down here with that ancient chief. What about that crazy looking old man that attacked you? Oh, he looks Spanish to you? What did he? What's that say? It's asking for forgiveness. Release. Escape. And it says, kill me. Oh my god, Dave! Uh, uh, Alan, take it! I, I saw, I saw! It's okay, hey, relax, relax, relax. <laughs> Dave, I think it's dislocated, all right? It's all right. My brother did the same thing when we were kids. <laughs> Sorry, pal. This is gonna hurt. Ah! Oh, we should get him back to the barracks. Yeah. We don't have time for this. We need to keep searching for an exit. Oh, come on, Paulina. No one's stopping you, Alan. Just, uh, don't forget to come find us if you find a way out. Fine, we'll stick together. <laughs> Easy. Okay, watch your head. Uh, 
I'll stay with him. You guys go on. Nothing's wrong. The curse is real. You should rest. Is somebody there? We're not one floor down, are we? I saw these exact same pictures in the room before. It's the natives, okay? It must be. Tyler, the natives, they're just screwing with us. No fuck bus you. Pepe? Mother of God. What have you done to yourself? I am witness now. There must always be a witness. She told me. Who told you? Mi madre. Someone must carry their pain. You listen to me, Pepe. Your mother is dead. Only one. Forever. I've had enough of this shit. <laughs> Dr. Mona's protecting me. Screw you, Pepe. It's okay. Easy, Pepe. Take it easy. It's best you hear the warnings of your ancestors. Sorry. It was an accident. She was choking me. Who? My sister. There was an accident. You don't have to tell me. You don't have to tell me. In the end, do you think we have to pay for our sins? I hope not.
The old native dropped this outside the cave. This is the female. The male is down here somewhere. If you can put the two back together, maybe we can get the hell out of here. Because it is not possible, that's why. The order was given in 1944 when the U.S. Marines were overtaking oh, the island. It's a tourist gimmick for history! I suppose that the guy that just blew his brains out was a suicidal World War II reenactor, huh? You're saying we're not on a different floor. We're in a different time. Yeah, it's the only thing that makes any sense. <laughs> That's the only thing that makes sense? <laughs> Do you hear yourself? Are you buying this? No! This is not an option! Okay? Listen to yourselves! This is insane! None of this is real! Paulina? Tyler? Stop messing around! Okay, I'm... Are we the only sane ones left? No, he's right. Whatever's happening to us, it's my fault. Paulina, come on. You couldn't have you know, known. If it wasn't for me, we'd be back at the hotel, we'd be having drinks, and we'd be talking about what an asshole Alan is, and I'm the one that insisted we come down here. You're right. Alan is a huge asshole. <laughs> You are completely wrong about the rest, but Alan is definitely an asshole. Dave gave me this. He said the old native dropped it outside. It's the matching female to the male doll that's supposed to be down here. Hmm. <laughs> sure looks like the one in the painting. He said if we reunite them, then we may be able to get out of here. Uh, look, I just told everybody that I think we traveled back in time, so I'm willing to try anything right now. Come on. Maybe this will give us some clues. This is bullshit. This bullshit is just the native screw. It is the native screw. Enough of this voodoo crap, Pepe. You come and face me like a man. Hey, I'm talking to you! Hey! Pepe! Have you... Pepe! Pepe, come back! Listen, I just want to talk! Pepe, listen. Listen, it's okay. I get it. Okay. You're one of the protesters, right? That's it, isn't it? You've been working with them from the start. You want to scare the white devil away from your sacred ground. <laughs> it's genius. Come on, Pepe. Show us a way out of here and I'll tell the police whatever you want. You hear me, Pepe? Get us out of here and all's forgiven! Is it money? 
You want money? You get me out of here, Pepe. And I'll pay you whatever you want. You hear me? Name your price! Pepe! I'm gonna go check on Dave. Who's down there? Mommy? Yes, sweetie, it's me. I'm cold. I'm so sorry, Jack. I should have been watching you. Where are you? I'm right here now. Mommy's... Mommy's right Did you forget about me? Of course not. I love you. wasn't real. Okay? Yeah. I didn't know you had a son. I lost him six years ago. I'm so sorry. He was six. And we were at the pier. And I was with this guy I was dating and I... I I got distracted. I took my eyes off of him for one minute. Then he was gone. The next morning, his body washed up on shore. He must have fallen in. That's why I can't be with anyone. Can you understand that? So standoffish, Paulina. Hmm? You should 
have just told me. It doesn't matter. I know he's gonna be one lucky guy. What did you just say? She moaned like a whore when I railed her. Don't you ever talk about her like that again. What's going on, Tyler? I will rip your goddamn throat after saying that. Tyler! I didn't say anything. He didn't say anything. He said that you and Harry... Easy. I'm sorry. You're hearing things. The same thing happened to the soldiers here. It's in the diary. Sure. The officer and his men were stationed here during World War II. A soldier named Kato started behaving irrationally. The male Bojabo. Uh, enough with the stupid dolls. Doesn't this look just like the female doll from the painting? The old native dropped it outside and Dave brought it in. Kato continues to be insubordinate. Kato! What are you They found a passage to Gehenna, the room where the curse originated. What did the creature say? 
Um, he just wrote it down phonetically. Uh, ah. Solo uno puede vivir. Solo uno puede vivir. That's Spanish. Only one can live. Huh. Well, um, you know, the Japanese were ordered to hold the island until the very end, and so they did. Ah, uh, but. I am the only sane one left. I know what I must do. It is done. Well, that was a load of help, wasn't it? You listen to me. Pepe has gone off the deep end. He's destroyed the radio and he's cut himself. Which one of us is next? Hmm? Well, you two can just sit here and think about it, and I'll go and do what has to be done. I'll find him. You don't think Pepe would murder us? I don't know. But the last thing the soldier said was that he would make amends with his life. So he killed himself. Seems my life is not amends enough. How long must I live in this hell alone? We need to find that room. He was recording. Who's Claire? His dead sister. Pepe had a knife. And Alan was right. The generator must be dying. Come on. 
Come on, we, we have to hurry. Stay behind me. See the camera. It's not real. It's not real. It's not real. There's nothing there. See? I saw. Oh God. And that's it. Did you see him again? Hey, hey. Like you said, none of this is real. Okay? Here, 
Let me. Smells even worse down here. Oh, thank God I found you. Alan. Dave's dead. We think it was Pepe. Nope. That would be me. Tyler! Tyler, 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 wake up. Come on, talk to me, wake up. Why? Why? You think I'm gonna wait till this place makes you all crazy and you chop me up? No, 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 Paulina. I'm gonna strike first. Come here! Come back! Where are you going? Where are you going? You can't run from me! That's nowhere to go! Solo uno puede vivir. Only one can live. Tormento para todos. Torment to all. Testigo por eternidad. Witness for eternity. Torment for eternity. Now you understand. Oh Spanish man come here to enslave our people, so shaman enslave him. He kept him here, alone, for over 300 years. Where did you find her? The old native dropped it outside and Dave picked it up. He should not have done that. This can all end now. We can end the curse and be free. <laughs> that is not what my ancestors want. But it's got nothing to do with us. We weren't even born yet. We weren't born yet. Even now, time matters not in this place. We slide back so put Jobo can be together. Yes, so they can be together. They want to be together. It's I, All can be forgiven. Don't you worry, sweetheart. You'll get yours. No forgiveness! Don't! We had a chance!
I am Guy Tao Tao. Those spirits protect me. Understand. One witness for Chose him on my ass. It's me and you, Paulina. Shoot you down right now. Pull it up.
only one can live. So sorry. What are you waiting for? Get on with it!
We had a chance! You win both, but you not understand. Here in the dark, in about 70 years, only one. Forever. Hi guys, George Washington was not first president to live in the White House. Uh, nope, it was not the first president of the United States who lived in the White House. Uh, but John Adam and his wife uh, Abigail Will Washington did over the constructions uh, of the house. Uh, he never lived in it. Uh, it began being built in uh, 1792 and was not uh, inhabited until 118. Since Adam, each president who has uh, resisted in the White House uh, has made their own change and addition after all the lived there. The deadlier job in the country is president. Scientifically speaking, no job in the United States of America is more deadly than that of the president. Think about it. Uh, 45 men have held the title. Four of those men were assistants in office Abraham Lincoln, John F. Kennedy, Jam A. Greffield, and William McLean. Well, for dead of natural cases, William Henry Harrison, Zachary Taylor, Varian Harding, and Frank Lyons, Delon resolved that a rate of almost 80% or nearly one of the five holded on the job would you apply for a job with those kind of status independence day did not happen on july 4th nope july 2nd was the day the congress vote to free up us for british rules however the 4th of july is when john hancock wrote the first signature on the declarations of independence in order to spread the word of the vote 56 men signed the document that announced intended independence from British rules. They more than one copy of the original Declarations of Independence Day. After the adoptions of the Declaration of Independence, the world observably needed to be spread. The reproduction of these taxes was overseen by the Committee of 5000 Jeffrons. John Adam, Benjamin, Franklin, Roger, Sherman, and Robert R. 
living sessions will hundreds of copies were made only 26 survival today most can found in museum and liberations however there are probably owned speaking of the declaration of independence in light of the 56 signature we are british 56 men signed the declarations of independence from England, age of whom were actually British. Sure, the majors of the signer were native born American, but a light hair blade from across the Atlantic. Do they are from Indley Bended from Wales, or from the Scotland, two from Ireland, and one from Northern Ireland and Ireland? The average American threw away 4.4 pound of trash daily. It sounds crazy, but this is uh, true. According to the Environmental Protection Agency latest 2012 figures, uh, when you take into account American population, that means uh, the around 1.4 billion pound of trash gets uh, throughout uh, in the United States every signed day this make a nation of some of the most wasteful people on the interplanet in some state they are more cows than people move aside humans sorry we could not help ourselves the cow are here the stay according to vox adialo loba Kansasa, montana nebraska north dakota oklahoma south dakota and Wyoma have less human than their do cattle in this state combined there are 300 million plus cows they more than one third of america total cow population the tallest president was ibrahim lincoln the sixth president was a tall six feet four inches or 193 commences of smallest president to hold office was jam madison the fourth president whose turn was served from 189 to 1870 stood five feet and four inches tall or 163 meters centimeters he also weighed less than 100 pound the oldest president to serve was ronald reagan Ronald Reagan, the former Hollywood star and governor of California and over fourth president, took office at 69 and served two full terms from 1981 to 1989. Stepping down just five weeks, she of his 78th birthday, thought since our current president is 70, he could potently beat out the great communicator. The State of Liberty is not in New York. The Statue of Liberty, which had drawn pretty much every bite of tourism, mentally habit you can purchase in the Big Apple, is actually not located in New York City at all. It's technical in Jersey, the city, New Jersey, who knew the copper statue was a gift from France to the United States in October 1886. American fat about 100 acre of pizza each day. We love our pie and high. The we collectively we consumed 100 acres of pizza every single day. Annually, around 300 billion pizza are sold in the good oil USA. Not only that, but reported 93% of Americans have eaten pizza within the past month. The biggest peak in delivery sale of pizza occurred around the Super Bowl. Cannot get more American than that. Atlantic City has the world's longest broadwalk. Atlantic City has the world longest broadwalk. Bulletin 18070. It was also the first broadwalk in the United States. Its purpose have was the limit the amount of sand beach growers took with them into hotel lobbies as well as the train. Today, it stretches of 4.5 miles long and home to casino hotels, restaurants, and more. California state animal does not exist in California. Before the mid 118,000 of grassy bear could not be found across California, so much that the animal became the state official animal. Nowadays, all of the grizzlies are gone. What changed in the mind? 
1800 if you guess the state gold rush you are right on the money between the end 19022 every living grizzly in the state of california was captured or killed and all it go was a lossy flag the original capital of united state was philadelphia the country capital was not always washington dc a stupidly by the resident actually philadelphia was made to be the temporary capital of a new created united state of america between 1790 and 180 will washington dc was being bullet today you can still find many famous pieces of early us history through the capital of philadelphia so friend i hope you like this videos thanks for watching